Watch this. You mean that's it? Do you even know what it is? It's gum. Yeah. It's a stick of the most amazing and sensational gum in the whole universe. <laughs> know why? Know why? Because this gum is a full three-course dinner all by itself. <laughs> why would anyone want that? It will be the end of all kitchens and all cooking. Just a little strip of Wonka's magic chewing gum, and that is all you will ever need at breakfast, lunch, and dinner. This piece of gum happens to be tomato soup, roast beef, and blueberry pie. It sounds great. It sounds weird. Sounds like my kind of gum. I'd rather you didn't. There's still one or two things that are... Real. I'm the world record holder in chewing gum. I'm not afraid of anything. How is it, honey? It's amazing. Tomato soup, I can feel it running down my throat. Yeah, spit it out. Young lady, I think you'd better. It's changing. Roast beef with baked potato, crispy skin and butter. Keep chewing, kiddo. My little girl's gonna be the first person in the world to have a chewing gum meal. Yeah, I'm just a little concerned about the... Blueberry pie and ice cream. That part. What's happening to her nose? It's turning blue. Your whole nose has gone purple. What do you mean? Violet, you're turning violet. What's happening? Well, I told you I hadn't quite got it right, because it goes a little funny when it gets to the dessert. It's the blueberry pie that does it. I'm terribly sorry. <laughs> Filling up. Like a blueberry. I've tried it on like 20 Oompa Loompas and each one ended up as a blueberry. It's <laughs> just weird. <laughs> but I can't have a blueberry as a daughter. How is she supposed to compete? You could put her in a county fair. <laughs> I want you to roll Miss Beauregard into the boat and take her along to the juicing room at once. Okay. The juicing room? What are they going to do to her there? Uh, they're going to squeeze her like a little pimple. <laughs> we got to squeeze all that juice out of her immediately. <laughs> 